back at it again. And as y'all can see, all the cosplayers heading to the convention. So I'm gonna be here for a very, very long period of time. So hopefully to see everybody there at the convention. All right, we are live here at Florida Supercon and the bang dancers are doing the thing. So without further ado, I'm gonna go around the convention, interview some people and of course, have a really good time, so. Hey guys, what's going on? We're here live in Florida Supercon with Lifeline from Apex Legends. Uh -huh. So tell me, what brings you to Florida Supercon? Um, just all the figures, everything they have to offer, the body pillows, everything, and yeah, like, we love it. All right, and of course, the cosplayer choice is Lifeline, which is the best combat medic in Apex Legends. Literally the best character that, like, she carries the whole team, pretty much, and I use her a lot. I have a syringe. See? Always prepared and ready. So where can people find you on Instagram? Weave Draws, W-E-E-B Draws. All right. And with that being said, Mozambique here. Mozambique here. And stay classy. Thank you. All right. Okay. Hey, guys. I am live here at Florida Supercon with... Marie Hallow. Oh, my goodness. Hey, what's going on, Marie? Oh, hey. So awesome. yeah. <laughs> oh my god, we ran into each other again, just like last year. Alright, so what brought you to Florida Supercon again this year? Because I live here and I like to have fun and socialize with everybody. You guys are all so sweet. Like, <laughs> And the cosplay of choice, I see that you are Toga from My Hero Academia. Yes, I am. <laughs> and where can people find you on Instagram? At Marie Hollow on Instagram and also at Marie Hollow on TikTok. Alright, and with that being said, stay classy. All right, guys, I am live here at Florida Supercon with... Kakashi. All right, and what brings you to Florida Supercon this year? Uh, it's my first year, and I wanted to try oh it God, out. So famous. She's gonna be in a All right, and the cosplay of choice of, you know, Kakashi Hatake from Naruto and Naruto Shippuden and Boruto Next Generations. Yes. <laughs> and where can people find you on Instagram? Uh, KayaBear99. <laughs> All right, and with that being said, stay classy. All right, guys, what's going on? I'm here live at Florida Supercon with... Red Hood. And Raven. All right, guys, so tell me, what brings you guys to Florida Supercon this year? Well, for the entertainment, of course. All the cosplay. And your cosplays of choice. Raven, of course, for day, what, two? One of two. Red Hood, just love being a vigilante. All right, where can people find you guys on Instagram? Well, I have Facebook. She's the Instagrammer. Batgirl Mini 87. All right, with that being said, stay classy. Hey guys, what's going on? I'm live here in Florida Supercon with. Uh. <laughs> Grayson. Liz. All right, and what brings you to the Florida Supercon? I come every year because my mom has taken me since I was like five, like something. I don't know how wow. old. I don't know how old I was. Yeah. I'm. This is like my first con, so I'm here. It's not too far from my house, and I'm meeting up with this child. 
And what made you guys go with the cosplay of choice? Um, well, I, vo I, liked, I liked the show very much. And I was kind of hoping my meme died off a little bit. Kind of didn't, but I love the costume and I love the show and the characters and personalities, so that's it. This was like probably my favorite female character from Black Butler, and I've been meaning to do her like the whole time I was cosplaying. So where can people find you guys on Instagram? Pretzel underscore cosplays or pastel underscore T cosplays. And lizard underscore cause. All right. With that being said, stay classy. Hey, guys. What's going on? I'm live here at Florida Supercon with these two gentlemen. How's it going? What's up? All right. So we're bringing you guys to Florida Supercon this year. Um, well, you know, a friend of mine asked me if uh, I'd go with him this year, and well, why not? This guy. Uh, I brought him to the convention. It's a great place to come out and have fun. Uh, I did it last year down in the Fort Lauderdale area, and it was great fun. Now I got my buddy with me. I'm showing him the ropes, uh, informing him on everything, and showing him some of the, uh, the underbelly when he wants to. All right, what made you guys go with the cosplay of choice? Well, assassins are just cool, so it's just a thing that happened. Uh, for me, it was Noctis. He was a great character in the uh, video game Final Fantasy XV. And the style of the outfit that I went with, I wanted a big crop, and this was one of them that I did. It took me two days to make it, two long excruciating days, and I had to paint it myself. But other than that, it was built by pot. Power Up Props, shout out to them, they're a great company. And where can people find you guys on Instagram? <laughs> Nowhere. Uh, no <laughs> All righty, well, well, with that being said, stay classy. Hey guys, what's going on? I'm here at Florida Supercon with Captain Tukitake. Yeah, another captain here. How amazing is that? So tell me, what brings you to Florida Supercon? Well, this is my first time ever going to a convention. And I came here with a few friends. And I'm glad to meet you, Captain Tosin. You too, Tukitake. So tell me, what what made you go with the cosplay of choice as Captain Tukitake, another Gote 13 captain? This was my favorite captain of the series when I started watching it a while back. Like, I just... Once after I saw Captain Nuki Take literally save Ichigo's life, that is when I, that is when I, it was all over there. Like, that was my favorite character from there on out. What made you choose Captain Tosin? He struck me as a very ominous character that, it was like, I wanted to know more about him because the backstory that he gave about him, it was kind of short and small, but I still wanted to know more. So that's why I went with Tosin. So where can people find you on Instagram? People can find me on my Instagram. It's called uh, Island underscore Time 94. All right, and with that being said, stay classy. Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to Florida Supercon, and I'm here with Ichigo Kurosaki. What is up, guys? Woo! <laughs> what is up all the way to Supercon? Hey, if you guys haven't gone over here, 
come over here. It's great family fun. Epic out like us. Ichigo fans, Leech fans all the way. You already know. Repping that squad. And if you really want to have fun with the kids, bring them down here. They're going to have loads of fun. Absolutely. Meet, meet their voice actor, our heroes, meet other people who are child, children just like in their and their house. A lot of fun. Hope you guys come. So what made you go with the cosplay of choice as Ichigo Kurosaki? Oh, as Ichigo, bro, you can't mess with the classic. I mean, original, original Jump Force 1. Yes. Original anime 2. Yes. One of the longest animes like recorded next to One Piece until it finished. Really. Yeah, right. <laughs> right. And then, no, it's great fun. Everybody rubs, everybody rubs Bleach because they know that he is on point. He doesn't mess around and he's straight up. All right, where can people find you on Instagram? Fivo 2008 that's an Instagram and Twitter, and then on Facebook, not even my final form cosplay. There you go. All right, with that being said, stay classy. Stay classy. Woo! All right. I look magnificent. Hey guys, what's going on? I'm live here at Florida Supercon with Dio. You guys know I'm a huge fan of JoJo since I've gotten onto it, and I'm here with Miss Dio Brando. Hello. So tell me, what brings you to Florida Supercon? I come here like this is like my fifth time coming to Supercon, fifth year actually. Oh wow. So. This is my third year. So tell me, what made you go with Dio? I just recently got into JoJo, and he's like my favorite character. He is. Yeah, he's. He's my second he's favorite. Pretty cool. Okay, oh, is number one, but Dio's right there. Yeah, yeah, I really love Dio. So, where can people find you on Instagram? Uh, Coco V L L. All right, Coco as in C O C O. C O C O V L. All right, and with that being said, stay classy. Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to Florida Supercon, and I am here with... It's a Valentine's So tell me, what brings you to Florida Supercon this year? Um, I come every year to Florida Supercon. I like to dress up a certain lineup, and I try to make time for it okay. And the cosplay is just because your Vincent cosplay is by far A+. Plus. Like, wow. Like, this is literally the best cosplay of Vincent Valentine I've ever seen. And you completely nailed it. Like, what, what made you come up with it? What to be honest, I was watching Final Fantasy VII. I didn't play the games originally. Um, so I only saw the Advent Children movie. Ah, and for like the movie. five minutes he was in there, I was already a big fan. So I'm just like, the characters that make me fan grow the most, they like to dress up like. Gotcha. And where can people find you on Instagram? Um, I put mine on there as Slenderman's Nissens. Like Slenderman's underscore nuisance, and I have a picture of Jeff the Killer on there. Gotcha. That's where I can be found. All right, with that being said, stay classy.
All right, y'all, it's almost seven. It is time for me to go and hit the road and head on home. My feet are tired, my feet killing me. But I got so much to upload to YouTube and Facebook, so stick around. Hey guys, what's going on? Oh my God, what a day, man. What a freaking day. Day two of Florida Supercon is. And right now it is currently one in the morning. It is 1.08 in the morning. It is Saturday. Yeah, I should be going to bed right now. But I've been spending my time, you know, finishing up day two. Like, day two is about to be over 18 minutes long. So I'm just giving you guys that heads up that, yeah, I've been working on day two for a bit. And I already know, listen, day three is going to be insane. Like, what you guys will see in day two, man, is a lot. However, there are some discrepancies that I do have some some errors that I do have where I'll show you guys well for this person I tried to find their Instagram name but I couldn't but if I run into them then of course after this uploads I'll just you know put in the what the the time stamp and of course the cosplayers name same thing for wait why is this Okay, who else? Same thing for this person here. Like, I couldn't find her name or whatnot. So, about two people, I couldn't find their names. And, of course, this person here, I couldn't find his Instagram handle. So, but, you know, tomorrow I'll be able to find it and whatnot. But, yeah, day two was, yo, it was great. It was a lot of fun. I was there since 11. I left at 7. Tons of fun, man. And, you know, Thursday was slow, you know, not busy or whatnot. But Friday, you start to see more people, more people coming in and whatnot. And I can only imagine tomorrow, it is going to be chaos. And right now, I should be going to bed, should be go getting me some sleep and whatnot. So that way, I can be up early, drive down to Miami, Miami Beach, that is, which is about a... 45 50 minute drive find parking and do it all over again <laughs> and yeah i'm gonna be captain toes in throughout the entire week i might have to switch it up maybe 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 not i may sw do you know peek a pool or whatnot if i can find a way to look out of a mask but even then when i put that mask on like i i was struggling to breathe <laughs> but other than that man Yo, the interviews that I've done, it you know, it was like that was one of the biggest challenges for me was to do it on my own, like try to make it work on my own. And for the most part, I have found success in doing it. And it was just, I, I gotta put it like this: I I get a little bit nervous, you know. I get I get a little bit nervous. I get I, I sometimes I'm a little bit shy or whatnot. And when I want to do an interview with someone, I want I want to do it in an area where it is not. You know a giant cluster you know i want to be you know somewhere nice out and open where there's actually space and i can just you know get the interview done and whatnot and as you'll hear in the video like um i had to use uh, one of my uh audio receiving devices because the other one it would sometimes pick up audio sometimes it wouldn't so i'm just going to use the other one granted you'll hear literally everything but you'll get the result that you want and whatnot but other than that man Yesterday was fun, like a lot of fun. I had a really good time. Like I had so much fun to the point where I forgot to use the bathroom. I forgot to eat. And even though my feet were killing me, like I still had energy to keep going and keep looking around, you know, meet more cosplayers, even meet people that I've actually met, you know, people that that followed me since the very first Supercon or they just follow my page or what or they follow my not my of course my Facebook page and my Instagram and you know they stay up to date with everything that I post and and that I share and whatnot and then boom here I am in flesh and they meet me. I mean like that is such a great and awesome feeling to have man. Like I really truly felt happy about that. So I'm gonna get some sleep. This video's going on about almost five minutes so I don't want to drag it on for too long because 
already what I had to what I showed you guys for day two is long enough already. And there were some things that I just literally cut out and whatnot. But other than that, man, I'm gonna call it a night. You guys have a good one, and stick around for day three because I cannot wait. Because I'm gonna be at, I'm gonna be there for quite a longer period of time. So yeah. Anyway, guys, until next time, and as always, stay classy.